Hey guys, so I got asked on, was it one of my videos? I think it was one of my videos um, to do a video on how to go from wearing no makeup to like school or something like that to going to school with makeup and people not getting weirded out. You know what I mean? Like people being like, oh my god, she's wearing so much makeup all of a sudden. Um, okay, so personally what I did was... I, like, used to always wear foundation. Like, I wore tinted moisturizers at school, and then I worked my way into foundation, and that's all I really wore with mascara. Um, always, I always wore mascara. Like, I don't think anyone cares about mascara. It's just mascara. But I always wore foundation and mascara, and then eventually I started wearing eyeshadows. And it was always a neutral. Like, you know, it was always, like, one color on the lid, or, like, one color in the lid, and then a little bit in the crease, and just mascara and eyeliner or something like that. Or, actually, before that, I just wore, like, heaps of eyeliner, like, a winged eyeliner and mascara and foundation. Eventually, I started wearing, like, lipsticks every now and then. I think people just got used to me wearing makeup, like, because they saw me working my way into it. Um, and then, eventually, I pretty much wore, like, almost a full face of makeup almost every day. Um, if you don't want to take that route around, you know, doing your makeup and crap... I think a really good way to do it is to just, I don't know, like, if you you literally just wear, like, nothing, then start wearing a tinted moisturizer, tinted moisturizer, and, like, a powder, and then, like, some mascara, and then, you know, eventually just start wearing some eyeliner, um, if you want to wear eyeshadows, just use a really neutral, like, I don't know, champagne shade, or a really light brown, and then just blend it out, like, don't use anything else, just blend it out. I would practice at home if you're not too good at like eyeshadows. Practice at home at night time until you get good at it. Because honestly, um, you look back at some girls like years ago. Like I look back at some of like not my own pictures because I never left the house when I first started using eyeshadows. Like I wouldn't leave the house because it was terrible. But um, I look at some people and they have like bright lime green, just like a streak of it across their eye or something silly like that. So you know, just practice and then you know just wear really subtle makeup. And then if you want to start wearing blush, then just, you know, put a little tiny bit of a natural one on. Just work your way into it. Don't just come to school all of a sudden wearing drag queen makeup or something like that. Because everyone's just going to be like, holy crap. And another thing I wouldn't recommend is coming to school all of a sudden wearing like bright blue eyeliner. Or like bright green eyeshadow or bright purple eyeshadow. Or like red lips or something random. You know, just keep it really neutral for a while. And then like... You know, after a while, people will be used to it, and you can start coming wearing bright reds and all that kind of thing. If you want to start, like, filling in your eyebrows, then go ahead. Just don't make them real dramatic like mine or something. Just, you know, you can search tutorials on YouTube on how to naturally fill them in so that they're not, like, blocks or something. I don't know. Like, it's just pretty much like you just gradually work your way up to it. Just don't go cold turkey. Don't just start wearing dramatic stuff. Just go subtle first or just wear some things like if you do really want to go with a dramatic eye first of all just don't do it on the first day that people are going to see you wearing makeup like ever um you know like work your way up to it and then just wear a dramatic eye but don't do any like dramatic lips don't do any dramatic face makeup you know just wear like lighter foundation and stuff to start off with I don't know, those are just kind of what I think. If you've got any more tips for that person, then leave them down below. I'm sure she would appreciate reading your tips. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. Just work your way into it. Hope this video helped some of you, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!